What's up? What's going on, guys? Captain Monk here again. This is a gameplay commentary on the map Akara. I'm going to be using the CM901 assault rifle. And before I get started on the gameplay and what this video contains and stuff, I want to talk quickly about this weapon. There is a glitch with this weapon, guys, that if you use the grenade launcher or the shotgun attachment, its fire rate increases from 666. Yes, it's the number of the devil. Because this gun, honestly, is not that good unless you use a grenade launcher or a shotgun. But personally, that is not enough of a reward to um, use it. But if you do use it, it increases to 750 rounds per minute. So, it is a good a good round increase, I guess. But it's not really worth it for me. I'd rather be hidden from the radar. But I don't, I don't have to be using an assassin to do that. I can just basically dominate the other team with a suppressed weapon, and I'm good to go. I don't need assassin. Assassin's for pussies. But in this gameplay, guys, I do end up getting a very high kill streak, and I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and spoil it right now, guys. I can osprey gun in this gameplay, and this is probably my second game trying to get it. Maybe my third. It was pretty funny because my first time trying to get this this osprey gunner, I actually ended up getting it, but it was like one more kill before the game ended, and I had a pay blow up, so I couldn't call it in. So I was kind of bummed out about that. So I couldn't really, but I did get the Osprey gun, I just didn't get to call it in. So this is my first time actually using the thing, like my second time earning one. So I'm going to warn you guys, I'm not very good with it yet. I've only used it once, like I've said. But I, I'm, I'm pretty familiar with how to use it now, because it's one of those things that the first time you use it, you're like, whoa, what is this, what's happening? But the second time you use it, you're like, okay, I understand what's going to happen here, because that's just basically how it works. But in this game, right here, you start seeing me getting pretty campy, I'm not going to lie. But the reason for that is... There's basically two ways to get out of this. There's you go down the middle of the map towards that little bit of a broken down helicopter with a turret. Or I'm on this real road here. And the thing is, if you go on that road, it's just straight lines of sight. So I get shot from the back or, or in front of me. And I just hate going out there because it's so dangerous because you can get shot from both sides. And I wasn't really sure where I should be going because the spawns are so wacky in this game. So, I mean, if the action's coming to you and you're still alive, there's no reason to leave. So, yeah, I was kind of playing a little bit defensive here, but hey, you know what? It, it's not like I was sitting in a dark corner all game, right? I mean, I was getting kills at least every 20 seconds. And I can pick up this guy here for the pave low. And then right here, I get really campy because at this point, I again, like I said, I didn't already know where to go that would be safe. So I end up just staying where I am. And that's a little good pro tip, guys. If you do not feel safe leaving where you are, do not leave. Now, that does not mean, oh, if you're in a corner you don't, and you, feel, you don't feel safe leaving that corner. That does not mean stay in that corner. That means if you are in the middle of a, the enemy team's spawn or you're not sure where they're spawning, there's no reason for you not to stay in a safe, safer, safer area, basically. And right here, I pick up the Osprey Gunner. And you're just going to see right here that my Pavlo does some work. It does some serious work, guys. I mean, what do I get? Like, 13 gun kills? And I've already got the pave. Like I don't even. I wasn't counting, but guys, this pave low, it does some serious work. I try calling the Osprey gunner here because I didn't really know that it. Um, the pave low occupies the same kind of airspace as the Osprey gunner does because there's some attack helicopters and stuff that you can call it in. Call in, sorry, overlapping the other kill sticks. For example, you can call in the H6 Overwatch at the same time as the attack helicopter. That's just an example. So I didn't really know, so I was just testing it out. But one thing I do briefly want to talk about, guys, in this video is if you've noticed recently or maybe in, like, the last month or so, whatever time it was, I have removed all my subscribers from my main account, except for a few exceptions, but I'll get into that in a second. The reason for that is not because I hate you guys. I love you guys. You guys are great subscribers for the most part. But the thing is, is when I play on PS3 on this account, I kind of want to play with friends or I want to get a gameplay, and sometimes... I'm not going to lie, guys. Subscribers get in the way of that. I make it kind of more difficult. So, what I've done is I've had this account for a while, but I have two accounts, basically. And one of the accounts is this account, obviously, where I just play and get gameplays and play with friends. And my other account, I'm basically proclaimed to be, like, my subscriber account, where I'll go on maybe every once in a while. Like, like I'll try maybe go on every weekend for, like, an hour or two. And if you guys are on, I'll play with you guys. And I'll try to do that at least once a weekend. And that'll be fun. I mean, I mean, what's the, what's a good way of saying this? Like, if you guys want to play with me, just add me on my subscriber account. The PSN for this, I'm going to try to say this very clearly. It's CPT-MONK. You can say it one more time. CPT-MONK. If you're a subscriber, just add me on there and say in the message, I'm a subscriber or something like that. And I'll add you, no problem. 
and I'll go on there, or like maybe like I don't know, like for an hour or two every weekend, and I'll play with you guys for a bit. And I'll invite all my subscribers to my friends list. Whoever joins joins. If people don't join, they don't join. It's their loss, I guess. I mean, and I'll play with you guys. One really weird thing about this though, guys, that I find it's kind of funny is um, about a week ago when I started deleting all my subscribers from my friends list on my regular account, that is, I basically post on my channel like guys if you've noticed me you're on my friends anymore it's not that i hate you it's because i explained it all but i guess a lot of people didn't see it so that's why i'm making this video today so anyways guys that's the gameplay if you liked it give it a like like to like it a favorite if you guys want to see more videos like this go ahead and subscribe to my channel that'd be really awesome and i'll see you guys next time peace